Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Bearable IT. In this video, I'm going to show you how to work with summary fields in Salesforce. Now, a summary field requires you to have at least one grouped row in your report. And this is because you're going to be summarizing those grouped rows based on some kind of numeric field in your report. In my case, the amount field. Now, there's two different ways you can summarize a field. You can do it the quick and dirty way, which is click on it, summarize, and then click on one of these. This will get the job done, and you can you know, do up to these four values doing this kind of method, but I personally am not a fan of that method. I don't like the way it looks. Plus, I like having more control over it. So in the column section, you can go ahead and click here and add, form add summary formula for the second way of doing this. And you get control over the formatting. So you can do currency, number, percent, decimal places. And in addition to that, you get access to more fields, uh, sorry, more formulas and functions. So I can even do unique here. And there's all kinds of functions you can put over here, but we're not going to get into that in this video. For the display, you can say, I want on all summary levels. And we'll show you what that looks like. So I selected currency, all summary levels, two decimal points. And you can see right there, now it's doing both on the close date by month and account name, summarizing those up. And it also gives me a grand total. My other two options are grand total only, which is pretty straightforward. It'll just give me this one grand total down here. Or I can specify that I only want to do it on one of these groupings like closed it. That's really all there is to it for doing the simple summary fields. There's a lot more advanced things you can do like cumulative summed values and doing percentage of totals, but I'll cover those in a different video. Uh, if this video was helpful, please go ahead and leave a like, comment, consider subscribing, and as always, thanks for watching.